She'd been in and out of the hospital all of her life. They gave her 36 hours to live. It's in God's hands. That angel actually appeared on this monitor here, and within a day, she was on a nasal cannula, and a few days after that, home. Any doubt in your mind it was a miracle? No doubt whatsoever. Emergency. I got ran over by the real garage. You got ran over? Yeah. His body was trapped in this area and then twisted in the axles of the car. Essentially cut in half and he survived. How do you classify a miracle? Two investigators will scour the earth to uncover mysteries that transcend logic. One a believer. People who embrace this point of view are the ones who are doing best. The other a scientist. I think there are people coping equally well who don't share those beliefs. In search for truth. When I'm screaming, God, please save me, please. For about 11 seconds, it stops. And we're in complete quiet. A thousand reasons why I should be gone. Only one why I'm alive. God protected me. I believe that there are angels all around us. I don't know what's happening, but I know I've been cured. You don't believe that miracles happen. If I explain it, any needed debunking will take care of itself. The fact that someone contacts the, a spiritual realm is common to every single culture and every single religion. I thought, oh my gosh, this is the dream. And then he was heading straight towards me, and not one of the four people were hurt. That was a miracle. Let's look at how often accidents of this kind really happen and how often people make it through. I still say there must be an explanation, but our reality is bigger than the reality that you and I see. I'm not doing anything, are you? I'm not. Something happens in this place. There's something very threatening about randomness. Was I just walking with, with Jesus or a prophet? I have a hard time calling this a miracle. You say it's not real, I say it is. First thing, a regular heartbeat. If it weren't for him, honestly, I wouldn't be alive. I would be dead. You don't want to just say, uh, if, if natural science can't answer it, then it must be a miracle. Since miracles can only really be disproven, not proven, let people do whatever they can to disprove. Do you think your soul and James Houston's soul are the same soul? Yeah. He's soul of James Houston. He knew things that nobody else could know. This whole event is uh, encompassed by a much wider circle of humanity than I'd realized. I could see some marks in our hands. Stigmata. I'm a little bit skeptical. There will probably always be things that we don't understand. You know, ultimately, physics cannot explain it. The world needs to be shown that, that you know, maybe miracles do happen. I can't explain it. So to me, that's a miracle. I think it's a candidate for a miracle. If it's true, it'll be one of the most incredible things I've ever encountered.